Hello everyone, in this tutorial we will move our project inside one plugin so we easily migrate to your own project. First, we delete some function that we don't use it. Delete this find nearest plan. Calculate break input. Delete detect obstacles and we delete some variable that we don't use debug control and delete this debug break now let's move this variable to the category correct right category this road network move to component this we call actor to components and this floor actor components fit control let's move parent throttle and target throttle to speed control Debug control. Move this debug spawn spline. Obstacle. Move this previous and location to obstacle. Move to target. New target location. Go to move to target. And all this right ball, we create another category is Curvature. And move this to Culture. Next, we will move this function into the category. Search for text target arrival. Category is bit control. Top vehicle bit control. We call Speed control. Go to speed control. Is final target near last line. And this go to speed control. We try script. Create control. Get create center location. Create control. Draw debug sphere with point. Create control. Create index. To point, grid control, grid point to location, grid control, point to grid array, index array, grid control. Can reach grid edge grid control find nearest location obstacle
find by target location obstacle initialize view call mode obstacle get v call law i to obstacle is plan to short obstacle initialize we call ai obstacle Should found new path obstacle found avoiding obstacles plan obstacle isolate steering input go to steering Fear stress pattern location auto pattern fear stress pattern pattern find next plan location is pattern Perform pattern go to pattern turn vehicle with target location pattern has completed direction change pattern Perform reverse alignment pattern. Line dress obstacle forward to overlap. Line dress obstacle right overlap. Found New spline to move to target reset the force spline move to target set spline points move data move to target add hand location to target move to target reset line immediately move to target It just final target location. Move to target. Initialize. Move to target. Move to target category. To use round actor. Move to target. Create road network path. Move to target. Found the force line. Move to target. And 
adjust add away from obstacle we add new category is line post process refine add with obstacle avoidance line post post process it just and to the false plan line post process and all this function that it left is curvature category Temple point on spline to do curvature. This calculate So now we have the function that in the correct category and we have this variable that in the correct category can compile and we go to this traffic folder we need to delete the blueprint that we done use this 3D dynamic obstacle delete this force field this BP we call AI we delete this because now we use only this component E side we don't need this and we go to material and you can see that this material its parent is from level prototype so if we move it to the plugin we need the parent of this material too now let's add folder textures and find this material find this material go to texture and we copy this a grid checker a a to this textures and go to this parent copy this m prototype grid this mf rock grid and mi prototype grid gray we don't need to copy this gray we copy this m prototype grid and mf rock grid Ctrl C to throw this material and Ctrl V in this MF block grid we can change this texture use this texture that we just copy inside this traffic folder
and apply and sell this. Go to M prototype grid. And this MF block grid we change to this MF block grid. Apply and sell. And this MI prototype gray. We change this parent to this M prototype grid. And sell. We can rename this to MI prototype grid Y. So this material, we can use this MI prototype grid Y of the floor. Next, we can select all of this content. Right click, update redirectory. Delete and reference redirectory. And we rename this folder to be called AI. Like this. Take this folder and update redirectory. Delete. Now we can delete this folder, this traffic. The new folder name is we call AI. Add a new folder. This folder name is flying pound input. And inside this folder is actions let's go to third person this input action copy all of this and copy paste it here copy this imc default Rename this to IMC Flying Pound and open this mapping its chain to the new input action. This folder you can see the path is game. We call AI flying pound input action and we have the star here because we not yet save it. So change to this. IA move. IA look. IA down. IA up. And save. And next we go to BP fly pound. Go to event process and add mapping content. Change this IMC flying pound. And this IA look. Search for IA look. And this pad is flying pound input. So the same input but different location. This IA move.
split like this I add down this even ongoing trigger I A up on go in the year and compile and save. Now let's close this. Go to our project traffic tutorial and go to plugin. We want to change this name to from algorithm to vehicle AI. Change to vehicle AI. And this plugin name to vehicle AI. Go to source and this name to vehicle AI. Vehicle AI dot beer dot CS. This public vehicle AI BP library. We call AI dot H is private. We call AI BP library dot CBP. We call AI dot CBP. Next, we can delete dot BS binary derived data catch intermediate. Style VS Graphic We generate Visual Studio Next we open this traffic tutorial dot SLN Open this plugin we call AI dot U plugin Friendly name we change it to Intelligent we call AI. And this module name, then it to we call AI runtime preloading screen. The to we call AI dot build dot CS. Change this algorithm to we call AI. Same with this algorithm. We call AI. And this we call AI BP library. Change this name. We call AI BP library. This U we call AI BP library. And this we call AI dot H F we call AI module and this CPP. We call AI BP library dot H We call AI dot H and this U 
and rename this to you we call AI BP library apply and apply we change this name you we call AI BP library copy this and change all of this function you we call AI BP library save this the tool we call AI and this algorithm to we call AI dot H F we call AI module same with this F we call AI module this and this algorithm to we call AI save all and close this project let's generate Visual Studio project file Open Let's see this plugin dot build check if there is any error and let's run this let's play this and we get the error from we call AI component click compile and it cost by at point we see that this point is structure so we change the plugin name and we lost the struct at point so we need to paint this to point a star a finding reconnect again This call for each loop. This change to point structure. This to point. can reach grid edge point array this point
write this make point high index with index X and Y Right X. This X This Y And close all this function Now, this array or for each loop loop body write this and this one is y The total this array for each loop. This loop complete. Right. H to H, Y to Y. Delete this. Now we don't have any error. Save. Let's play test. So it is working. Now let's move this. We call AI all of this folder inside intelligent. We call AI content. Move it here. And then we select and update the directory, delete and reference, and delete this. Now our project is inside this. And we can delete this flying pound input folder and this material folder it is empty we can close this project close this visual studio and we will move this plugin inside this we call ai plugin this road network tool and we can copy this to folder road network tool road network tool editor go to plugin we call ai go to source paste it here Then we can delete this road network tool plugin. 
clean this project generate visual studio project files open this traffic tutorial sln go to traffic tutorial in we call ai dot u plug in and we need to add some module module name is road network tool type runtime loading phase default platform allow list win 64 win 64 and we can copy this module another one is road network pool editor and type is editor the fall in 64 and this plug in plug in name procedural mesh component enable true and another plugin name chaos we call plugin Enable True And we can add another platform allow list To this We call AI module Win64 Save this and let's run this project it's get error because this chaos we call with s we cause let's run again and we hit play we don't have any error we and access this road network tool as before and use this let's close this close visual studio now we can go to source and traffic tutorial public we can copy this my spline component and spline point data and we move it into this plugin to source we call AI public and 
and this private my line component dot cvp okay to be called ai private and back to source we can delete this two file and delete this my spline component and spline point data and this plugin let's rename this my spline component to better name navigation spline component change this to navigation spline component then regenerate visual studio go to graphic tutorial dot sln go to plugin we call ai and open this line point the tan dot h navigation spline component this class chain to we call ai api with capital letter and we can rename this you navigation line component like and we change this include navigation line component dot generated dot h go to this navigation and component and this include navigation line component dot h and rename this U navigation apply U navigation line component all of this save all let's close this and we delete intermediate generate this again open traffic tutorial dot sln let's run this project we have an error it caused by this u my spline component so close this it is u navigation spline component save and we run this again now if we hit play we will get a lot of error inside this repeat spline road because our spline we move the location and we change different name so and so to this we call ai and we paste flying road 
we get error from this spline and we lost the spline here that's at spline choose this navigation spline and rename it to spline compile now get spline get location at distance along spline connect this distance this with the get tension at distance along spline angle on net is distance is with the and copy this this location at distance along spline delete this engine at distance along spline world location delete this now let's compile and we have some more error we change this spline and get spline link we don't have any error in this bp spline road let's save this let's go to vehicle ai component and when we compile we get a lot of error from this spline so we need to reconnect the spline connect this spline to get number of spline points this spline to target get move forward at spline point and this point it to forward compile we need to reconnect this every function that we use spline will have this error connect this spline here we get spline point array array and we need to call set array element we connect this index this one we need to make plan make plan coin data into item and side to quit connect this we can delete this and close all this function and and we reconnect we 
this we get blank point that had a call for each loop then from this array or set array element use this index we make blank point data set to forward and connect to this item tie to fit delete this for each loop we can connect this loop with this when it complete all this set forward to true now this one just connect to the new spline And we close all these functions. Open a one graph. Compile. Now we don't have any error. Let's try play this. Check if it's still working. So everything is working correctly. Now let's delete all of this we call because we want to move this map to the plugin. Copy this map to the plugin. And we in this content add another folder is road network. And we style all the two city sample we call this map. Copy this. Go to this road network. Press it here. Name is M sample map. We can open this map. Next, we need to fill all level, and we can close this and save and create new material. Create new folder name is material. Let's go to we call AI and this material. Select this texture. Press Ctrl to select this road and this. Then we move it inside. We move it inside this material of this road network folder. and like all of this and update the directory in here we have the material and we can close this project 
กทูรอดมาส์ generator dot cpp and scroll down to this material location because we already changed the material location we need to change the new name we call ai road network material and m road in let's save this and run the project again now this road network tool let's try to create see if the material is correct and have the correct material this material of this road is inside this location this m road in and now let's try package this plugin to to plugin this intelligent vehicle ai go to our project location and create a new folder name is package open and select folder let's show output log So we get error and explicit category specifier is required for any property exposed to the detail blueprint in engine module. So this is the location of this error line 33 and 16 of we call AI BP blueprint BP library dot H. Go to that location. We call AI this. We call AI BP library dot H. It we get error from here. You property blueprint read and write. We need to add category. Category equal point. And this one category equal point. Go to we call AI dot dot CS and we can move this for you object and engine to this public dependency. And we can delete this. Save. And this quadri dot h. We need to include include draw debug apples h. Go to road mesh generator dot cpp and we include materials plus material interface dot h and pathfinding road pathfinding dot h component dot h we include engine plus 
engine.h include draw debug apples h save all close dot vs delete binary save you can go to this plugin and delete binary and intermediate and then we generate can delete this package we call AI open this graphic tutorial dot sln now run this project we can play this and we don't have we call this we call city sample let's drag this we call inside it and it is working we don't have any error clear this lock Save. go to plugin to this project package we package this plugin for window platform and now we successfully package this plugin so we can close this project in this package location we have this plugin we call AI and we can copy this plugin to use in your own project other than this project so let's try create another project go to epic game launcher and just create a simple project Line this Unreal Engine 5.4 and create click this game and choose this vehicle package we will add the vehicle AI to this vehicle and blueprint project now this name you can name whatever you want my project and then create and we can close this we can copy we call AI plugin that we just package and go to my project create a new folder is plugins and paste this plugin here then open this project and update this if we go to plugin and we can see that we have this intelligent we call AI plugin in a ball So go to this plugin and you can go to content and road network open this map if you create your own map make sure that this floor tag is floor add another tag and make sure that world Go to world setting and this game mode set to we call game mode to spawn the pound flying pound that we can control that vehicle 
go to v call v call template blueprint v call add count and we need to add the bar collision name this bug collision and add another vehicle ai component bug collision set this bug extend 220 8, 100 5 and z is 50 we can change this high to 80 and compile go to off-road car and we need to adjust this box collision it should be shorter and wider and move it forward a little bit we have the correct shape and then this spot can move this down move this bug forward this y we have the correct bug collision make sure this vehicle have vehicle movement component Now let's save this. We can drag this bot car inside the scene. And this off road car can drag this here to take it 180. Let's play. And we set this target location and our vehicle is using the vehicle AI component to navigate this road network. So we can control multiple vehicles, also this off-road vehicle. So now we can use this we call AI for other project by package into a plugin that is very easy to use. This is the end of our tutorial. If you like this tutorial, please hit like and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you very much for my patrons member who are supporting me. Your support make this tutorial possible. If you would like me to continue to update this project, or add more feature to this project, you can support me on Patreon. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the future tutorial.